Welcome to Jetkitico India official YouTube channel. Now I am going to explain about EFS 10 visible light device. So this device we mainly use for the attendance purpose as well as the access purpose. So now we will check what is the device capacity. So go for system info device capacity. Here you can see it is able to store the thousand user capacity and uh, it is able to store the 500 face and thousand cards and 150,000 transition capacity and also we can set the password for the verification for all the users this is the device capacity and this device requires two little power supply to run the device if you want any extra external battery for the power backup it comes with the optional you can select accordingly and uh, now this device will support the for the communication ethernet and wi-fi as a optional and uh, usb will comes with the default for the communication purpose and this device we can connect with the ZK Tico devices like EM lock, exit button, sensors, alarms for the access purpose. You can see the device it is having the 4.3 inch of touch screen display and camera for the face verification and also having the infrared feature. This is the visible light when the darkness is more the visible light will be getting enabled automatically so it is very easy to capture the face in the darkness also and you can see here the back side it is having the usb port here to take the data through usb and here it is the reset button to the device to do the device reset and back side this is the battery will comes for the additional power backup you can check here this is the tcpip port where we can connect the tcpip for the communication purpose and this is the direct power supply to load power supply we have connected here and if you are connecting this battery means you have to go for this port for the battery purpose and uh, this port is to connect the em lock exit button and sensors for the access purpose now we will check what are the options there in the main menu Inside main menu first option is user management where we can add a new user we can delete old user and we can edit the old user details and user role you can assign this role for any employee for the device operational purpose and you can do the changes also for what are the menus we need you need to give the access you can do the changes so it will ask for the what all the menus you want to give the access and com option here you can check ethernet setting cloud server setting pc connection you can check it here in the system you will be getting date and time setting attendance setting face setting and device reset also if you are using any usb upgrade file you can connect the usb and you can use the usb upgrade here and personalize here you can change the user interface related things voice prompts bell schedules and punch state enabling options in the data management you can delete the data like uh, delete all data delete admin role and attendance photo whatever if you want to delete you can go for the data management the access control you can do the changes for the access control options like uh, door delays timings door sensor delays and uh, door sensor type also you can choose here and uh, usb manager here you can download the data and you can upload the data through the usb Attendance search here you can search uh, attendance records, attendance photo, block list attendance photo by entering the user ID of a particular employee. And work code here if you have created any work code, multiple work code, whenever the employee will come and when he will do the punch, he will be getting the work code and uh, he has to choose then the report will come under that particular work code number only. An auto test here you can test the whole device like LCD you can test here camera and the voice everything you can test it here in the auto test and in the system info here you can test the device capacity like what all the free space and what is this filled space you can test it in the system info and device info here you will be getting the device name serial number MAC address everything you will be getting in the device related information and the firmware information here you can get it firmware version bio uh, service push service what is the versions are there you will be get it here so this device we can connect with the jetkitico softwares like easy time to easy wd mesh intelligent time kind of softwares 
This is all about the e-fest and device. Thank you.